Hello, this is Mr. Inadequate, and I am trying out a game that launched today in early access on Steam, Captain of Industry. Uh, this is, I don't know how long this video will be, but, you know, I just want to give a blind look at it. I've watched a video or two, but that doesn't mean much to me, because I learn by playing, not by watching. So, new game. Map selection. We're going to take this, excuse me, this map because it's the easy map. Now, we're going to leave everything standard and go to game difficulty. Now, we're going to leave it on Sailor because I haven't played this game at all. And as you notice, on Sailor, you get 50% increased starting materials, 30% reduced fuel consumption, 40% reduced maintenance consumption, 30% uh, ore mining yield, and world mine deposits is 100% increased. Electricity production, 20% increased. Settler consumption, 20% reduced. Unity production, 20% increased. And uh, rainwater yield 40% increase, farms yield 20% increase, base health 10% increase, weather's less dry, and uh, construction costs is 25% reduced, quick repair is enabled, and uh, we'll leave it on this game seed. Now, I have the tutorial things <coughs> up. And I will try to follow them. What I'm looking for is if you want to see more of Captains of Industry. I'll play it anyway, but okay. Now, welcome, Captain. Our ship and the local shipyard will both need major repairs. The man abandoned communication station. Uh, should could be deconstructed and used to smelt iron in a blast furnace. Also, it's essential to build a research lab. And a friendly village you can trade with is nearby. Check the world map. And trading can be a lifesaver if you run into a shortage of critical products. So you should research and build a trading dock as soon as possible. So, this is the communication center. We're going to start recycling that. Okay, now. Blast, blast furnace, right? And research. I'm going to pause this. Blast furnace. Now, i got to be very careful here, because huh. I'm going to build it there. Now, Research lab. We're gonna let's build that there. Okay. So this is the one we know about. Okay. Wow. We want to make a coal builder.
Ow. So everything's starting to go. Now I'm going to pause it because I want to see something. Okay, this is what I'm looking for. We got groundwater up here. That's coal. That's got to be oil. That's limestone. That's copper. That's iron. That's got to be sand. Do we have any gold? Yeah, gold. No, oh, that's sand. There's the gold. Okay. Moving around the map is uh, WASD. Okay. <coughs> waste and dumping. Your, gen your population generates waste that needs to be collected to maintain healthy conditions in your settlement. You can attach a waste collection to your settlement to get rid of its waste. Dumping area, Ziki, which I can't use because that's how I tape. Let's see. Okay. Wow, wait till things get built here. Oh, no research selected. Now. Farms. Beacon. Okay, so let's research farms. I'm going to tell you right now, it's going to be a short video as I try to figure out what to do. So, research has got to be this. Start that. Those are the first three it had mentioned. Okay. Now. There's got to be a way to assign trucks. Oh. Yeah.
know how to assign them. take a lot of learning. Wow. Okay, this is going to be a short video because <coughs> I definitely am not able to play this without some more research. But you've seen what it looks like. And uh, the big question here is do you want to see more of this? It's going to take me some learning. I got to fool around with this. But uh, definitely looks interesting. And uh, this is Mr. Inadequate playing Captains of Industry. First look. Let me know what you think. See you next time.